Good morning. This is my teacher fit for the day. Our shirt says, be kind. Did you miss me? channel my name is Georgia it's been such a while since I've talked to the camera um, I'm so glad you found your way here I like to post videos about being vegan cooking baking um, random vlogs um, I have some vlogs about being in college false vegan you know how that goes <laughs> broke vegan shall I say I also have moving vlogs i have videos about cleaning my car just really random videos you should just scroll through my channel and see what else i have but this video in particular is going to be just like a few days in my life i've been alone all week oh my gosh oh wait we should start with updates hold on how do you do the reverse sound <laughs> so i live alone now if you remember from my was it my last video um, I moved to Houston after living in Huntsville. I moved in with my cousin and he got a really awesome opportunity to work at the Texas State Aquarium in Corpus, which is what his job was before, but he decided to leave to come here and it, like explore different jobs and stuff, but it, it just didn't work out that way. So he ended up going back home to Corpus, but he's still paying for the apartment here. So... At least he didn't like leave me to pay for the whole place by myself. <laughs> that would be really terrible. But basically I'm just living alone. Like sometimes my partner will come and stay with me, but he works too. So it's not like he's here all the time, but I am, I'm like nesting, nesting <laughs> for a dog. I'm like gathering things um, to get a dog. Hopefully by my birthday, I'll have one or like the weekend after. So today is Thursday. Um, today is my busiest day at work. I am like constantly on the go, 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 putting out fires, you know how it goes as a teacher. <laughs> I ran around a lot today with my kids and I'm like exhausted. I really felt my age today. I'm 22, but I really felt my age today. So every day after work, I'll go to the gym. So today is not out of the ordinary. I haven't been going to the gym as consistently this week because I have had so many things to do on saturday i have a gala to go to that is through my school so i was trying to find a dress and i spent all tuesday afternoon i think with my mom looking for dresses i went to the store on monday to try to find a dress but i didn't like any of the dresses i found and then i went to the store on tuesday with my mom she liked the dress that i tried on on monday so i went back to that store on wednesdays to get the dress and then i had to take it to the cleaner and it was just like a whole thing like it's just i just had a lot going on in afternoons i guess but i am so excited for the gala this weekend i can't wait to see everybody. I can't wait to socialize. Love socializing. Oh, and that's what this is, actually. This coat is for, this is for the gala. I'm borrowing this cute little purse from my aunt. Last night, I made um, vegan scallops out of a king oyster mushroom, and it was really good, actually. I took it for lunch today. In my experience, when you cook king oyster mushrooms, they're really tough. I made bacon out of king oyster mushrooms and it was just really, really tough to bite it. It wasn't, even when I baked it longer or put it in the air fryer for longer, it got crispier, but it didn't get easier to chew. <laughs> so I was a little um, apprehensive, but it actually turned out pretty good. And the consistency is in my mind, really similar to scallops. Today is also the first day that I've come straight home after work and just like, relax <laughs> like did nothing I still I did bring some I brought my work laptop today because I realized there were some things that I needed to work on right now I'm gonna go ahead and go to the gym so grab your running shoes or your weights or your resistance bands 
and definitely some water and let's go. which means I'm kind of late. I had to leave, <laughs> I'm supposed to leave at seven, just five minutes. My outfit is more relaxed today because on Fridays we have a half day. My kids leave at around 12.15, so the rest of my work day will just be me sitting at the desk, <laughs> typing, walking around, using the laminator. Love the lamination machine, it's so fun. But I have some things to do after work. I have to go pick up my dress, it should be um, done at the cleaners. I need to stop at the store to get more vegan cheese. I really like the vegan cheese at Walmart. It's great value. Mozzarella, it melts okay and um, it has an okay taste on its own. <laughs> I keep saying okay, but vegan cheese by itself is like not super great unless you're getting um, the baby bell cheeses. Oh my gosh, those are so good. And then I'm meeting some friends to go to a vegan junk food pop-up in Houston. So first of all, we gotta get to work. Hi! All right, so it's the end of my work day. It's about four o'clock now. I got off work at a three-ish and I just picked up my dress. It's very long. <laughs> this is kind of what it looks like. You'll see it on me tomorrow when I put it on. So I'm about to head out to a vegan food pop-up thing in Heights. So it's gonna take me like 40 minutes to get there because it is four o'clock in Houston. And if you are from Houston, you know how traffic is here. So yeah, I'm meeting City and Riddy there. I saw on their um, menu that they posted on Facebook, they have hamburger fries and I have to know what that's about. Place. <laughs> I'm ready. I'm Schultz. How do we start? Yeah. I'm German. How do we... Oh. I don't know. How... Oh. Okay. I think I'm getting the hang of this. So I got hamburger fries. Looks like a mess. <laughs> it looks yummy. What'd you get ready? Wow, Hawaiian something burger. Hawaiian. It has pickles in it. Not pineapple. Pineapple. pineapple? <laughs> Not pickles. Obviously they'll have pickles. It has, does it, is it fried pineapple? Or? I believe so. We'll never Ooh, know. But coleslaw? 
so yum. I agree. I What'd agree. you get, Sadie? I got the barbecue sauce on my burger. Is she saucy? Barbecue chicken burger. Should we go play games again? You're not even shooting. Here we go. Get him! Bro, we just press these buttons and beat them up. Oh, oh, what? Why are they? Oh. Good morning. It is now Saturday morning. It's about, well, actually, I think it's afternoon now. It's about 12. So I am getting ready to go to a tutoring session. I didn't end up going to yoga or the gym this morning because my boyfriend is over, so it just made sense to stay. And also, I was very sleepy, so I slept in. So that was nice. He made me breakfast, so we're about to go eat that. Also, I picked out my clothes for my tutoring session, which I'm supposed to be looking professional, right? I found out there's a stain on the back. And I've been having trouble with stains today because that dress that I got for the gala, I found multiple stains on it yesterday when I was putting it on after I got it all pressed and everything. And now I'm trying to take this one stain out that's like on kind of like where my butt is but lower. And I think it's really noticeable, but I don't know. I'm really stressing about the gala now. I used dish soap to kind of lift it. I don't know if that's going to work. It works on ducks, right? To get the oil off ducks. I think it's an oil stain. And the dress I think is satin. I don't know, I'm freaking out, man. This is what it looks like right now. I'm trying. But there are like stains all over the dress. I mean, I got it from Goodwill, so beggars can't be choosers, right? But like, come on, man. I forgot to get a video of my teacher fit, but I'm actually kind of running, I'm not running behind, but I like to get there at least three minutes before, and looks like I'm gonna get there maybe like 20 minutes before she gets there. So um, that's kind of stressing me out. But this is what it looks like. I like very professional. Hello, I'm back. So after my tutoring session, I went to Francesca's to get a shawl, wait, which was kind of expensive by the way. Like, this is just a piece of fabric, but it was more than $10. That's insane. I also stopped to get hairspray. So, it's already 5. I totally lost, lost track of time, so I need to start getting ready. Can you do me a favor? Yes. Can you get my gold bag from underneath the sink? It's in the third cabinet. Like, closest to the bathtub. Closest to the toilet. Not that exactly one. what you were talking about. <laughs> uh, I was just about to say, right now, amazing, you told me exactly what it was. <laughs> so it's kind of bulky. It looks like it has a lot of stuff in it. But it's that size, that pink size. Is it see-through? No. <laughs> it's like right in front of the basket that has my curling iron, my scrunchies. No, not the basket. <laughs> No, I'm just gonna walk over there in a second. It's okay. No, no, no. It's okay. No, 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 no. Here are all of the bags. One of the things here. None of these are it. Okay, well, that's all of them. <laughs>
Good evening, everybody. Uh, it's been a minute since I talked to you guys. So it is Sunday evening or, or Sunday afternoon. I don't even really know what time it is, but my sister is on her way over right now. Um, so we are currently making dinner for the three of us and I wanted to bake some bread and make cookies. All right, just finished the focaccia. Wow, that's hot. <laughs> the inside is very soft and like kind of melts in your mouth a little bit. We also have some Brookies baking. <laughs> Hello, it's me. <laughs> it's actually Tuesday now. I think the last time I filmed was Sunday. Um, so a little bit of time jump. <laughs> so let's reverse to Saturday. Um, I don't think I talked to you guys about the gala. It was so cool. Um, it was very nice. It was in a place I had never been to. I had to walk up a lot of stairs in stilettos. Um, so that was a little hard. But I also got a bruise on my foot from walking in those shoes. So I am going to give those away. Um, I think it's the end of their time. But it was cool because I got to see a lot of my coworkers in a different light. Um, makeup, like nice dresses. Um, it was just very cool. And then Sunday, my sister did come over. We made dinner. My boyfriend made dinner, actually. He made it all by himself. I'm really proud of him. <laughs> like he's a child. <laughs> no, what, what I'm saying is he really struggles with making vegan food. He's not vegan. He's just kind of wrapping his head around how to make vegan things. Um, for me, I kind of have it down, so I am constantly making things that are vegan just because I, like, need to live. But anyways, it was really, really tasty. They were, like, little taco cups. Oh my gosh, they're so good. He put Taco Bell seasoning on it. I've never had, at least I don't think I have, I don't think I've ever had Taco Bell meat before. So, it was really good. Um, he said that it tasted a lot like the meat. Or it tasted like the meat that they serve at Taco Bell. And then last night, we made pasta. I wanted pasta like with red sauce and veggies and stuff. And he wanted mac and cheese. So we like did half and half, kind of. And then topped it with some vegan chicken. I think it's that. I think it's Morningstar brands. And then I just had the red pasta, the red sauce pasta today for lunch. I actually had a coworker the other day ask me what kind of foods I make and like what I bring for lunch and stuff like that. So maybe I'll do like a week of bringing my lunch to school or something like that. I don't know. I'll workshop the idea. If you have suggestions of any videos that you want to see, whether it be um, Houston videos, like going somewhere, trying some kinds of food or cooking videos let me know or cleaning videos i know you guys love that <laughs> but i'm actually going to be closing this vlog off today um but look for more videos to come i will definitely be making more i'm very inconsistent with my posting though so it would probably be a good idea if you subscribe to me be sure to give this video a like all right i really appreciate each and every one of you for taking the time out of your day to watch this video it means so much to me even though i don't know who you are you faceless nameless beautiful person um, I still appreciate you. But if you want me to know you, you could definitely leave a comment and I will respond. Unless it's creepy, then I will probably flag it and block you. Huh. So I will see you guys in the next video. Bye!